MV Dali. Dali, Part One, Construction. On October 10th, 2014, Dali's keel was laid down at the shipyard of HD Hyundai Heavy Industries, located in Ulsan, South Korea. On December 27, 2014, Dali was launched. The ship has a length of 300 meters. In March of 2015, Dali was commissioned. Dali entered service as a container ship and is chartered by the Danish shipping company Maersk. Dali is the sister ship of MV Cezanne. Dali, part two, bad omen. On July 11, 2016, Dali collided with her dock in the port of Antwerp, Belgium. The collision critically damaged the ship's stern. Dolly would later be repaired and put back into service. Despite this, some superstitious sailors saw the collision as a bad omen for Dolly. Dolly, part three, disaster. On March 26, 2024, at 12.44 a.m., MV Dali departed the port of Baltimore, bound for Colombo, Sri Lanka. On board Dali during this voyage were 22 crew members and two harbor pilots. At 1.24 a.m., less than one hour into the voyage, Dali lost all electrical power. Using the ship's emergency system, Dali's crew sent out a Mayday message and warned authorities that there was a risk of an elision with the Francis Scott Key Bridge. Open to the public on March 23, 1977, the Francis Scott Key Bridge was a 2,632-meter-long steel arch bridge that connected Baltimore and Dundalk, Maryland, United States. Upon receiving the message, authorities closed the bridge to traffic. As the container ship was approaching the bridge, the crew dropped Dolly's anchors in an attempt to stop the ship from hitting the bridge. A short distance from the bridge, Dolly's power came back on. However, by that time it was just too late. On March 26, 2024, at 1.28 a.m., Dali collided with one of the central support pillars. Shortly afterwards, the Francis Scott Key Bridge collapsed into the Patapsco River. The collapse of the bridge damaged Dali's bow and sent into the river at least five vehicles and several bridge workers who were doing maintenance repairs at the time. By 1.35 a.m., 
a large-scale rescue operation was launched. Small boats, a helicopter, and a team of 50 rescue divers were deployed on the scene in the hope of finding survivors. None of Dolly's crew and harbor pilots were injured during the collapse of the bridge. At the time of the release of this video, two survivors had been rescued. One of them was in critical condition, while the other did not have any injuries. Six of the workers are currently presumed dead. Rest in peace to all those who lost their lives on March 26, 2024, during the elision of MV Dali with the Francis Scott Key Bridge. May they never be forgotten.